What is up everybody and welcome to a game called Lazarette. Now this is a pretty new horror game, came out about two weeks ago at this point. This video was supposed to come out last week, but then I got sort of sick and then I started replaying God of War Ragnarok, so I didn't really want to play anything else. So apologies if I still sound a little bit nasally, still kind of getting out of all this sickness, so bear with me please. But from what I've seen, this is a survival horror game set on what appears to be an abandoned ghost ship. It's been getting pretty good reviews, so I figured we would give it a shot. I think this game is pretty long, so let's not waste any more time. Let's just get right into it. Four years ago, a ship called the MTS Endurance disappeared on its voyage across the Atlantic Ocean. It has recently re-emerged. You are a member of a rescue team sent to investigate a distress signal coming from the once lost cargo vessel. All attempts to communicate with the ship have failed. Ooh. Spooky and scary. Cool. Getting choppered in. That's not what you said. This looks like the cargo ship from Modern Warfare. Like the original one. Where's Captain Bryce? Dude, I can see a million places I'd put this helicopter down. But I guess I'm just uh, a better pilot than you. Yeah, I can do that, sure. That seems like a good idea. Let's, dude, your hands are gone. You can't repel without gloves like that. That's fine. This guy is a superhuman, clearly. Okay. Need to find a way below deck. Can I sprint? It doesn't look like it. That's that's good. Alright. The crane should be able to move this. Move this shipping container blocking your path. Oh shit, okay, we're right into this. I don't I don't know how to operate a crane, is that okay? I never learned. Ooh yeah. You see, me, I would not be climbing up this bitch. Oh my goodness. Okay, so we need a key. I can procure that for you. Um Why would you not come down with a flashlight? You are a fool, John. Um I don't think I can go that way, so let's go back across, I guess. Seems like the best course of action. Yeah, just keep circling, guys. No need to assist me. Why is that here? Whatever. I'll take it. I will take it. I've always wanted to see if my fear of heights would kick in climbing a ladder like this. I feel like having the cage would make it a little bit easier for me, but I don't know. I, I still don't know if I could really do it. I don't know if I trust myself to pull something like that off. Alright, cool. No, what are you doing? No! Uh, okay. I thought about to climb me all the way back down. Okay, let's continue. Yeah, no, I'd be shitting my pants. Cage or no cage, I'm still high up once I'm done with the ladder. Alright, so I'm not trained to do this. Maybe I am. I mean, I am a rescue crew. Oh, weird. Okay. Oh, ho. Oh, dude, just looking down, and it's a fucking video game. F uh, for a cargo ship, not a, not really a whole lot of cargo. There's like a dozen contain- well, there's maybe more than a dozen, but there's not that many containers on this ship. You know, you don't- you, I feel like they wouldn't waste a trip with this little cargo. But hey, what do I know? I'm not a captain. Eh, I'm wet, though. I am very wet. It's fine. It's fine. 
Oh, I thought that was a person. Am I going the wrong way? No. I swear I just heard whispering. Am I losing my mind? Let's go! We found our way in, baby! Ooh, okay. Whoa. Weather notice. Green, clear. Yellow, potential danger. Red, adverse weather. Well, I would agree with you. Okay. We're in. I've always thought this is a very cool setting for a horror game. Um, there's been a couple of games that have tried it. Uh... I guess the most notable would be Man of Medan. Which, in my opinion, was kind of a disappointment. Uh, spoiler alert, if you've never played Man of Medan. But uh, I hate the whole, it was all in your head trope. It's such a, it's just such a, like an easy gimmick. What the fuck is that? Why is there a person frozen in time? No, that's cool. No, that is ideal. Uh, but yeah, I hate that trope in games. I don't know if trope's even really the right word. Find anything? Is this how walkie-talkies work? Uh, yeah, there's a person standing. Not yet, but it looks like we're ri riding with the log. Hey, dude, no, you just saw... How did you send that so quickly? Make your way up to the superstructure. You should be able to release a log down from the bridge, and maybe someone up there can tell us what's going on. Okay. <laughs> Ugh, sorry. Still a little sniffly. Uh... What is that noise? Hello? Okay, so we need a code. Search efforts are underway to locate a research ship that has gone missing in the Atlantic. The ship which was designed to dredge up important archaeological rec relics from the seabed has gone missing along with its entire crew, including renowned archaeologist Dr. Alfred Hayes. Oh. Dr. Hayes, the lead researcher for the expedition, had reported finding a most unusual artifact before the ship's disappearance. No further details of the artifact were transmitted, leaving researchers to speculate on what this new discovery could have been. The article seems to be most recent in a stack of newspaper clippings of similar disappearances going back decades. Oh. So we found some. This ship found something. Something paranormal. Something supernatural. Okay. Oh, I can sprint. It just takes a moment to, like, power up. That's interesting. Okay. Uh, I heard something back here. I know this was locked, but I heard movement. Maybe that's just the ship noises. But yeah, there was a game that came out a couple years ago, I think. I don't remember what it was called. I never played it. Um, but I just remember seeing stuff about it on Reddit. And it looked pretty good. But this is a very scary setting. Like... Uh, just like, regardless of who the enemy is... Because not only... Are you in a tight... Claustrophobic space, a lot of people are already, like, afraid of to begin with. You know, a lot of people don't like water vessels... In the first place. And that's, like, a source of fear. But then you have the added thing, like, even if you can't escape the interior, if you can get out of the ship, you have nowhere to go. You know? You're still fucked. Oh, goodness me. That's a person. No reaction? Hey, whatever. I guess if you're like a search and rescue team, you might be used to shit like this. I still can't imagine you, ha you having no reaction to this, though. You know what I mean? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Yeah, okay, so everyone's fucking dead. They boarded up the doors before they died. Uh, okay, why did these guys not get turned into barnacles? What's the difference there? I'm sure we'll, I'm sure we'll learn. 1947, cool. So we got the code for that. Oh, nice. Can I get a gun? I thought th I thought this was a gun at first. Hide- oh god. You guys know how I feel about hide mechanics in games. Now I know I'm gonna have to hide from something.
What the fuck? Okay, so is there like something... We got like a Medusa thing going on or something? No, that's good. No, that's fucking perfect. Okay, so we've got Tentacle Crab Lady Medusa fucking up everybody on this ship. Perfect. That's what I was hoping for. Okay, what was it, 1947? Let's -a go unlock the briefcase. I don't like the chains, man. I don't like all this noise, because I don't know what noises to be afraid of. Stairwell. This was locked, right? Yeah. Okay. What the fuck? I don't like this. <laughs> yeah, no. Not a fan of this game whatsoever so far. Which means I like it. Okay, oh, Poopsie Daisy is 19. Uh, 70. 4. Forty-seven. It was forty-seven. Sorry. Ooh, a fucking toy anchor. Cool. Picked up anchor relic. What good could that possibly do me? Why do I need a fucking anchor relic? And why is it getting more... Why is it getting louder? Um... Did I see anything anchor related? I'm gonna look through here first. That just goes back up. This is locked. Okay. Interesting. I doubt I'm meant to go back up to the surface. That's that's not how these games tend to operate, so. We're gonna go back down. Uh can I move this box out of the way? No? Okay, cool. That's perfect. No, I like it. I love it. I want some more of it. Can I unlock this with the anchor relic? Okay, can't like equip it or anything. Let's go deeper. Okay. Well. Oh, and they walk now. That's fucking wonderful. Fucking shit, I thought they were going to be frozen the entire time. Oh, I don't like it. I don't like it, I don't like it, I don't like it. Okay. Can't be broken by hand. Dude, I'm looking at these and they, they absolutely could be. Like, you could definitely rip these out of the door frame. But okay. That's fine. Can I go through, maybe? No. Okay. Uh, Henry and the doctor left to destroy communications equipment two days ago. They still aren't back. Why would they destroy the communications equipment? At this point, we can only assume they're dead. Yeah. Fair assumption. Are you gone? Okay, now you're still there. Cool. So, I'm assuming they came upon some sort of relic. Oh. Well, that's not how locked doors work. That uh, has something paranormal going on. And they disrupted it. Like dumbasses. Okay. I'm into it. Oh, God. That looks a little... Bloody and chunky. I'm sure it's just the lighting. Uh, how do you guys feel about boats? Are you afraid of boats? Are you afraid of water? I don't mind water. Hey, what are you doing down there, buddy? Uh, I watched the Titanic movie, I think a little bit too young, and it gave me kind of a fear of boats for a while. But I got over it relatively young. I've been on a couple cruises, and they're fun. You know, I feel like that's 
where a lot of people draw the line if they're afraid of boats. Like, they wouldn't go on a cruise. I fucking loved it. It was corny. It was cheesy. I mean, it was... It, it was about what you'd expect from a cheap cruise. Uh, but... Hold on. Some of the crew were desperately trying to get the main deck to... Trying to get to the main deck today. Despite the captain's orders to not go outside. They were adamant that they had to get above the deck. And even some had to be physically restrained. The weather lock system has been overdriven to stop anyone from trying this again. Like it or not, we're all stuck here now. Oh, okay. This is like some... Like bird box or some shit. Where it tries to get you to come out to expose yourself. Um, I went on a I went on a cruise. And that... The sleep I had on that cruise ship... Fucking best sleep I've ever had in my life. Like, ever. I don't trust this. Cool. I keep thinking they're gonna, like, fuck... Why? <laughs> Why? You tell me how to run? Oh, I'm so on edge. Why why are you telling me how to run? I'm okay walking. Really. I am. Fuck this, man. What is this? In Obel, baby! Holy shit, I never thought I'd see the day. Um only the real I'm getting out of this bitch. Only the true fans will know the Obel baby lore. But, uh... The, like, the gentle sway of the ship, and... It looks like we're leaking fuel. We need to head back now, but we'll return as soon as possible. We'll be out of communication range until then. Hey, Simon, go fuck yourself, buddy. Literally. Uh, the pitch black rooms... And the, uh... The gentle sway of the boat, man, that shit was amazing. I slept like a motherfucking baby. Okay, I'm assuming this is not for that. Cool. No perfect. No perfect. Um. Hey, let me out. Hey, buddy, what, what's wrong with you? He had some bad, bad lobster. It happens. It happens, man. Puke it out. You'll feel better. Okay, I'm assuming this is for this. Nice. Okay, into the stairwell we venture. This is a fucking sketchy looking stairwell. Don't know if I'd trust it. Can I press the button? No. Ooh, that's a long corridor. Don't want to go down there. At our last stop, we picked up an extra passenger. While it's not unheard of, it's definitely out of the ordinary. I've tried asking the captain about the new arrival, but he dodges the question every time. So far, the mystery passenger has mostly kept himself, but I'll be keeping an eye on him. Probably a good idea. Dude, can I get a fucking flashlight? I don't like all these fuckers. I'm saving. I'm saving this fucking game right now. It's too dark. Okay, sure. I'm fine with that. Fine by me. Seems like the guy I'm playing as has a pretty good head on her shoulders. I like it. Um, Speaking of Obel, baby. I think until... Du I almost said until Dwan... I don't know why. We're playing like a game of Marco Polo. Um, oh, cool. No, that's what I wanted. Uh, I believe Until Dawn is getting a remake here soon. And I believe I'm going to be playing that on the channel. Um, I loved the original. Not that it's really going to be different. <laughs> That wasn't even scary, it was just a loud noise. Okay, give me the crowbar. I know what to use this for. Um, I love Supermassive games. I wish I, could, I was able to play them all on the channel. But, I mean, I guess I could. 
but there's a certain amount of time that passes where it seems like unless you're just a huge name on YouTube, it just seems kind of silly to play the games that have already been done a million times because most people have already seen them and they don't want to watch you play them. So it's kind of pointless. Hello, buddy. Plus, I've already played them, so like, no. But I want to. I want to do the re the remaster on this channel. I think that'd be fun. Um. Just since it might be something a little bit new. Okay, so I need to go pry those boards. Uh, there's also the Alone in the Dark. I guess it's a remake, technically. I guess that's kind of how they're marketing it. Um, but... The, the new Alone in the Dark is coming out, I think, in like a few weeks. I'm going to be trying to play that as well. I'm really trying to kind of do more long-form good games on this channel rather than just, you know, doing silly indie games. I could do that. I could just spam, you know, a 10 or 20 minute long Ichio game every other day. But it's just not that fun to me. I like playing good games. Uh, I like playing story-driven games. The statues have started to appear on the third day. Just one or two at first, but more would show up every day, and by the end of the week there were dozens of them. Multiple pages have been torn out. Some of the statues have started moving. They've killed three people already. When evacuating the quarantined areas, I whistled to get the crew's attention, and one of the statues whistled back. Oh, cool. We've only had one more fatality in the last week. Whistling has proven an effective way of avoiding danger, though they won't respond if you're too close. Still, I think it'd be a best for them... Still, I think it would be best for the rest of us to find a safe place to hole up for now. More pa torn out pages. There's not many of us left now. The engines have stopped, but we can't get to the bridge. There's something else on this ship, and it stalks the corridors looking for survivors. The safest place for us right now is in this room. I just hope we're rescued soon. Well, how'd that turn out for you, partner? Uh... Nearby threats. Ooh. <laughs> I don't know if I like that. Let's go. Flashlight, baby. What do I do? Okay, does the whistling scare them away? Okay. What? Okay, somebody's whistling from down there. Uh... I don't like this. I would have rather just not fucking known about the danger. Because now I don't know what to do. I'm like getting closer to this. This is horrible. This is actually quite unnerving. Oh, okay, cool. Whatever. Alright. Nothing down here, baby. Right? Perfect. Okay. Um. This is awful. I fucking hate this game. I'm just waiting for one of them to fucking move. Oh, God, dude. This is... This is terrible. Okay, um, what was I talking about? Oh yeah, playing longer games. I, like, I could just, I, I know that, like, there's, there's no such thing as, like, a upload schedule on this channel. Like, sometimes I'll upload, like, three times in a week, sometimes it'll be, like, two weeks between uploads. But that's just because I really try and find games that I actually want to play. Um, I think it's more enjoyable for everybody when that's the case. Because I think when I like think a game is terribly dog shit, it comes through in my gameplay. Uh, I don't really hide it. Uh, you know, so... I think it's best I play games I actually like. Or can enjoy. You know what I mean? What was that noise? Okay, that was just this, cool.
I don't know what to do about the whistling man. He's coming through. It's coming through there. Is he like following me? Now it's gone. I don't. I don't know. Okay, let's continue. I guess. Ah, dude, chill the fuck out. Or am I getting too close? Because it says it won't work if you're too close. Can I flip the fucking power, please? The slides are missing. Okay. Cool. Not a fan. Cool. That's fine. I didn't want to go that way anyways. He's killed most of us, but not just killed. Some of us ha he marked. A pair of old coins placed over the eyes. After a time, the body starts to move again. I haven't seen what happens next, but I've heard it. Bones twisting, flesh tearing, and then silence. The body is gone after that. Most of it, anyways. Goodness me. What the fuck was that noise? Oh, goodness. I don't like this. I didn't know this was one of those. This is an outlast? Ah, oh, fuck. Hey, buddy. Fuck right off, please. Please don't open this. I don't want to run. Just fight him. Is this the guy who's whistling at me? Because he sounded like a fucking gorilla. Ah, oh, fuck this, dude. Can I hear him? I think I can still hear him. Dude, this is the worst game I've ever played in my life. They all stopped at the same time. Okay, so I'm assuming the time is the code. I've got to find a clock though, where is this? Cool. I know where that is. Hey buddy. Alright. Let's skedaddle. How often should I be whispering? I mean, whistling. Does that draw him towards me? What time is it? 11.35 I hope that's that big motherfucker who's whistling back because I have to like be wary of two different people yeah that's not ideal cool what's in here? screwdriver The fuck do I need a screwdriver for? What sick joke are you playing, buddy? Screwdriver? What do I need a fucking screwdriver for? Oh, fuck. Oh, fucky shit. Uh, what do I do? Should I turn my flashlight? How close is he? Have I gone this way? No. Yes, I have, but I can't go that way any further. So does that mean he's down there? So should I go this way? Uh, I'm... I'm a little foggy. On the system here. He's gonna be down here, isn't he? Fuck this. Okay, why... Dude, I'm actually very on edge right now, and I... I'm not having a good time. Ooh. 
What do I need a screwdriver for, dude? Not that. Uh... I don't know if I don't get a whistle back because he's too close or because he's f too far. And I don't really fucking like that aspect of all this, you know? Not a huge fan. I don't know what should bring comfort. Okay. Uh, I'm assuming whatever I need a screwdriver for. Wait, what is this? This? Was this log beforehand? I did not see this. Probably? Oh, cool. Yeah, I want to be in here. No, I want to be in here for sure. Uh, okay. New area unlocked. Let's fucking go, baby. Wait, is this is this a new area? Okay, I got the slides. Nice. What is this? A moon sigil? Okay, cool. The crew and I have been able to find out a little bit more about our mysterious passenger. His name is Aaron Hayes, a doctor of archaeology. Turns out he has some cargo stored in the hold, but I haven't been able to find what it is yet. The whole situation is suspicious. Yeah, no shit, buddy. Uh-oh. Is he outside? He's outside, isn't he? Can I open this? I can open that, but I don't really want to. What is this? Just a... Just a non... Non-identifiable chunk? Cool. He's, like, definitely right outside. This is the worst. Where is he? Just fucking go, dude. Just fucking run. Okay, wrong way. Wrong way to run. I've only seen him once. Oh, he's down there. Right? That's where the whistle's coming from. Fuck this. Fuck this game. Fuck this game. Fuck this game. Okay. Whatever. Put the slides in. Let's figure this shit out. Wait, is that it? What do I do with this? Okay, there's something behind there. But what room is this? Okay. That's the one with the, the thing. Is he coming? Why can't I hide? Oh, oh fucking fuck, fuck, fuck. Okay, fuck. No, we're fine, we're fine. We're good, we're good, we're good. He's... he's a bitch. That's what we'll call him. He's afraid. He doesn't want this smoke. Guys, I'm on edge. I'm so fucking on edge and it's really not funny. Like, I know it might be funny to observe, but I promise you this is not enjoyable for me, the person, the, the, the guy here. Okay, whatever. I think I know where- it, it's just around here, right? I'm just gonna keep on fucking whistling, but I really don't think I'm doing anything. Move this. What was that noise? Press switch. Let's fucking go, baby. Okay, so now we got a moon and a sun. What are we doing? Building a mural? 
superstructure. What the fuck is a superstructure? I'm not a captain. No, actually, what do I need a moon and a sun for? Is it back up here or something? Oh, wait, 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 wait. I'm dumb. I know where this goes. I know where this goes. It's on that wooden door, right? Surely. Surely, surely, surely. If not, I, I'm fucking lost. I have not the slightest clue if it's not there, so hopefully. Hopefully I am correct. Bing bong. I think this guy's a pussy. I don't think he actually wants to smoke. Oh! Oh! I lied! Open the fucking door! Am I dead? Am I just actually dead here? No, we're good. We're good. Wait, is that planned? You better run, bitch. Are you quick? No, you're not. Okay, you're actually- you, you, you're quick for your size. You've got some speed for your- for your stature. Go. Go, 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 go. You better turn that bitch. It's worth the tetanus. Yeah, like that motherfucker can't open this bitch. Yeah, what do you think was gonna happen there, buddy? Dude, why are you so gentle with this guy? Not a scream. Not a scare. You're just like fucking caressing his wrist as he chokes you to death. What a freak. Okay, so I'm assuming the sun and sigil thing was... Sun and moon sigil was... Uh... Planned. Is it sigil or sigil? It's sigil, right? I always forget. Oh, no. Hey, at least they broke your fall. Okay, that's a lot of dead people. That's m whoa. That's a lot more than I thought. At least I get my flashlight. Can I? Cr I can't climb over. No, that's fine. Okay. So we awoke the scuba diver monster. Okay. One thing that has slightly taken me out of it is. I know that voice actors are expensive, but you could at least, like, record some screams. This guy is just chilling out as he gets fucking attacked by an 18-foot-tall scuba diver monster. You know, that seems a little uh, unrealistic. Fucking elevator fuses, man. Whatever. Okay, so I'm assuming that's the guy we woke up. Or the team of archaeologists woke up. What you guys doing down there? I hope he didn't come down here. I would like a, a chance to catch the shit in my pants. We came upon a fog bank today. There was no chance of sailing around it, so we've had to sail th straight through. Something about it makes me uneasy. With everything else going on, on aboard the ship, it feels like a bad omen. Well, you were correct, my partner. Get a, get a fucking mallet. Get something. Set this fucker on fire. You've got a... Why? Is he in here? Huh? Wait, but like, I can see that he's not on that side, right? So like, I'm safe to open this door, right? It's locked. Okay, I'm fucking stupid. Come on. Up you go. Okay, can't go that way. Looks like we've had our direction chosen for us. That's fine by me, actually. That's preferred. 
really. Okay, not going through there. That's fine. I'm a little on edge, still. I got the first scare out of the way, which is always good. Okay, and there's the, the tentacle monster. Who's growling? What is this? What's with all this uh, noise going on in here? Are you looking through? Are you looking at me or something? No? You're just loud? Okay, cool, whatever. That's fine. Fine by me. Whatever. Okay, we've got a bunch of symbols. Is that uh, in correspondence to this? Yes. Okay, so we've got uh, like a C. I hear our friend out there. We've got something that does not look like a cat whatsoever, but it kind of reminds me of a cat, so I'm going to call it the cat. Got a C, got a cat. Uh, we've got... What's back here? A peanut. A C, a cat, a peanut. And what is through door number four? A C, a cat, a peanut. I could just start guessing since I know the other three, but that seems like a loser. A loser thing to do. I've been keeping an eye on Dr. Hayes throughout the voyage, and he's been behaving very strangely. He tends to avoid... What is that noise? Avoid the crew and refuses to talk to anyone. Instead, he usually occupies his time tinkering with strange contraptions. He's installed some unusual door locking mechanisms around the ship. You can't even go from the workshops to the boiler room now, and the captain won't do anything about it. Sounds like the captain's a pussy, if you ask me. But hey. Dude, can you stop being a goofball? I don't want to hear that shit. Okay? Oh, here we go. And a trident. Okay, cat, peanut, C, trident. Got it. Alright, so trident. Uh, peanut. Wait, what? Oh, peanut. C. And the cat. Cool. Let's fucking go, baby. Through the door! Who's banging? We got a survivor, maybe? Locked in the cargo ship? Hopefully. I would like another human to converse with. But it's probably not a human, right? I mean, that's... That's wishful thinking, I have to assume. Is it this one? No. Cool. Someone just opened a door. Um, that dialogue sounds, not sound, well, kind of, but it reminds me a lot of, holy shit, dude. Props. Nice ass. Uh, that dialogue reminds me a lot of Dark Souls. It sounds like when you're talking to, uh, oh, what, what's his fucking name? The guy, the light guy, I fucking forget his name. I played that game at least 15 times. How do I not? It's like Solomon, right? It's not, it's not Solomon, though. It's like Solomon. Right? I don't, I don't fucking know. I forget, man. I forget. Wait, what am I doing? Why is this keeping on away? Bring the shipping manifest. Find a way back to the upper decks. Okay, shipping manifest to the cargo hold. Gotcha, brother. Um, but that... I guess it was partially the way the guy was talking. And also... Part... The quality. It just reminded me of... Dark Souls dialogue. 
God, I need to, I need to replay Dark Souls again. Okay, back through. No one has ever done this this slowly, but hey, you can be the first. That's fine. I won't judge. Okay, that's right. I fell down all this shit. Okay, I don't think this is the way to go. Do this again. Cool. Come on. Alright. So... I need the elevator fuse. I think is a, is a solid guess, right? That's what I'm gonna need to find. So maybe these doors are open over here? I didn't actually check these. Okay, yeah, they are open. Cool. I was actually really hoping I wouldn't hear anything. But that's fine. Okay, we've got another vent area. More buttons. We've been sailing through this fog for an entire day now, and it doesn't show any signs of dissipating. It's pretty disorienting. The fog's so thick you can't tell if it's day or night. It sounds like the crew on the main deck are being affected by it pretty badly. The captain's ordered that time on the main deck should be limited to necessary work only. I hope we're out of this soon. Yeah, I don't think that happened, pa partner. Um, where was that noise coming from? I can I can feel myself getting more and more nasally as this continues. So please forgive me. The handle is missing. Okay. All kinds of shit missing on this fucking ship, huh? You didn't only kill everybody. You also fucked up the integrity of everything. Where did you go? It's a dead end. Oh, it goes up. Okay. Good. I was about to start being pissy. He's, like, right outside. He sounds like he's in pain. Any of y'all got a handle? Let's fucking go, baby. Hey, how you doing, pal? Okay. Lots of these mallets. I'm very confused as to how to interpret this whistling. Because that whistle made it sound like he was inside of these vents. Um, and logically, that'd be the only place I could hear a whistle coming from. If he's not in the room with me. Oh, okay. So, who are you? I think if you whistle it... I don't think I'm whistling for Big Daddy. I don't think he... Uh, I don't think he's the one who's dissuaded by the whistles. I think it's just like the mannequin people, right? You stay down there. I don't really want to talk to you. Let's go. Turn that bitch. And forward we venture. Anything in here? I can't even really see what's going on in there. I hear somebody walking around. Uh, dude, there's so much. There's so much missing. Gotta repair water pumps, elevators, handles. It's fucking ridiculous, man. Security room. Oh. Fuck you. Oh, shit. Ow. You fucker. The fuck's your deal, man? It's unfair. You got fucking hands made of stone. And you're punching a guy made out of flesh. Bitch, move. Not gonna lie to you, buddy. Not gonna lie. Okay, so the security room is back where we talked to Solomon, which is what I'm calling him from here on out. Right? It's back up here, correct? I do believe. 
I do believe, I do believe. What is that fucking noise? Am I supposed to, like, be able to tell what the sources of these noises are? He just moved. Right? He for certain moved, correct? Where the fuck did you go? Are you following me? What do I do? Just get in the fucking security room, man. Before you die. Okay. What is this? Shipping manifest. Okay, cool. Dude, they're fucking teleporting. They're fucking teleporting and I don't like it. They're getting more active as the night progresses. It's only night one. Come on. There's something weird in cargo hold two. As I was inspecting the machinery, I heard a strange rhythmic humming sound coming from one of the containers. I tried to investigate, but the cargo inspector stopped me and said he'd look into it. I haven't heard the sound since. The cargo inspector doesn't say anything when questioned about it and pretends to not have any memory of the encounter. Sounds like the cargo inspector's up to some shady shit there, brother. Best to not pry any further. Because there's a weird mannequin men who want to kill us. So, bigger fish to fry, I would say. Alright, buddy, I've got this shipping manifest. Uh, if you could make these people stop uh, chasing after me with their big concrete asses, that'd be great. And he's gone. He's gone. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Fuse. Feels like I've been down here forever. Taking the fuse from the freight elevator has stopped anything from getting down here, but rations are running low. I'll need to get out of here soon. Passage between cargo holds 1 and 2 is flooded. I'll need a drain before I can reach the elevator up to the superstructure, but the pump is broken. There should be replacement parts on one of the service decks. What are my chances of making it alone? Maybe I'll just wait here a bit longer. Okay. So, hey buddy. Fuck the fuck off. Ah. Okay, does this do anything to me? Or do you just punch me for fucking fun? You shit- Do they all do that? Oh. I'm starting to get hurt. That's not good. I should stop that. Okay, so I need- Wait a second. Uh. Notes. Uh, da 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 A way out. Let's see. Service decks. Okay. Need to get to the service deck. Okay, so they are fucking weeping, weeping angeling me at this point. I guess that's what the whistling is to prevent, correct? I can't use this elevator, though, until I unflood the... Uh, unflood everything, right? Or is this I just can't use it all the way up? Mm. Okay. I just don't think I can get up to the superstructure yet. Whatever the fuck that is. Sounds like a made up word to me. Got it. Okay, now it's time to find the water pump. Let's go. Go ahead and save here. Nice. And I'm stuck already. Okay. I somehow did not see that door whatsoever. Not gonna lie to you. I think the whistling is to prevent those guys from sneaking up on me. That's my interpretation as of now. Not sure how correct that is. Hopefully, very. Okay. Well, you're gonna hurt me. Let's 
Okay. A piece is missing. What the fuck? Who's behind me? Why did that do that? Okay, we're, we're fine. We're good. That was never a problem. What did I pick up? Safety storage room key. Safety storage room key. Well, what the fuck is a safety storage room key? We've been trying to get the engines back up and running for days now with no success. Some of the crew are starting to become despondent. Unfortunately, many of them have also taken up Doc Trey's infuriating hobby of building random contraptions. What does that mean? Why are they building random contraptions? And out of what? Maybe that's where all my fucking parts are. It is very quiet. Safety storage room key. Okay. Yeah, okay. I mean, I was... I was thinking maybe it was the one... Uh, above the floor. But I don't think it is. The one down above the cargo. How do I get through here without dying? This is not fun. Okay, dead end, cool. I love dead ends. If you guys could just not attack me for a while, that'd be ideal. I'm just gonna keep whistling. Okay, that person's alive. Or appears to be, at least. I should follow him, right? You know what, maybe this is a bad idea, actually. There's a lot going on right now that I'm not a fan of. Uh, okay, that says storage. Promising. Oh, fucking cock. Dude. Fuck you, man. Every time. Okay. Mm, what do I need from here? There's just shoes and hats and pants. And, oh my. Cool. Nothing worthwhile. Awesome. We received a radio signal from a rescue team today. We tried to respond and let them know our situation, but were unable to transmit. There was no sign of the helicopter through the fog. After a while, we heard the rescue team say they couldn't see any sign of the ship and would begin searching a different area. Strangely, they said they had a clear view all the way to the horizon. The radio has been quite quiet ever since. I feel sick. Our only hope now is to get the engines working. Okay. Cool. Time for a puzzle. I'm assuming I can. Okay. Just, just wanted to make sure. Um, this doesn't seem like the kind of game where I need to explore all the dead ends. So I'm just going to try to retrace my steps. I think I came this way. Oh, let's fucking go. I swear I'm hearing fucking footsteps, man. Whew. Okay. Time for a puzzle. This fucker's still in here. Just gonna go around you. Okay. Uh, oh, I can just rotate him. I thought I heard him move. So, I'm assuming I need to get the one up there. To go to the one down at the bottom. And that would make sense, right? Do 
Do all of these have to be used? Okay, that's not correct. Uh Oops. Let's fucking go. Cargo door cargo hold door controls. Why did my camera just turn off? I think it overheated. Cool. All right, so one of these days I should uh, really look into why my camera stops working or turns off or overheats or whatever after a single hour of use, but not a problem for today. What did I do last? I opened up the cargo hold door. I think, I think that's what happened. Uh-oh. 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 Well, we're gonna die. It was good. It was good knowing you guys. It was really good knowing you guys. Oh, what the fuck? Hey, buddy. You wanna go first one? Oh. It was all a dream. Okay. Cool. Whatever. I don't... I was about to say, I don't know where the cargo hold is, but yeah, I do. It's this way. Hey, guys. If y'all can just fuck off today, that'd be wonderful. Wah, wah. I bet you eat my ass instead of whistling so much. Okie dokie, not that way. Uh. Is where I found the key the cargo hold because that was down here right no wait the cargo holds this way okay good to know good to know good to know so it's somewhere in this maze of people cool where have i not gone yet okay this way looks like Dude, I thought those were footsteps and I had a mini heart attack. I'm not gonna lie to you. Can't close that? Cool. Perfect. Didn't want to anyways. Okay. What's all that noise in there, partner? It's a little quiet. A little quiet in here, guys. Oh, fuck. Are you shitting me? Are you shitting my asshole? Cool. Hey buddy, you got a flashlight per chance? No? Machinery, cool. Yeah, no, I like this. I like being completely trapped in the dark. Close that. Okay, is there gonna be a water pump replacement in here maybe? I was woken up early this morning by a loud scraping sound against the side of the ship. I thought I might have hit something in the fog, but when I ran to the main deck, there was nothing. There have been other sounds heard intermittently throughout the day. Banging on the hull, the sound of scraped metal, a low rumble from beneath the ship. Each sound was investigated, but we found nothing. Ooh, spooky and scary. The way I like it. This part is bolted on. Oh, fuck you, buddy. Seems like we need a tool. Okay. Not concerned about taking the water pump from this part might fuck up, you know, the rest of the ship. Nah. Hey, you guys, fuck off, okay? Don't want to see you walking near me, bitch. Oh. Hey, buddy. Chill the fuck out. Chill the fuck out. Okay. Uh, I can go this way, but I should go this way. Like I said, I've been playing God of War, and it's very much... Rusted shut, okay. It's very much a game where, like, 
or at least, I was about to say you feel like, but I guess not everyone plays games like this, but I feel like I have to explore everything. Like, if I lose a single piece of loot, I'm gonna fucking, I'm gonna ruin my gaming experience. So, it's very strange to be playing that for like the last 20 hours, and then to start playing a game. Okay, we're missing a cog, I guess. Or a gear. Whatever. Uh, it's very strange to then, to now be playing a game where a lot of things are just dead ends or not really worth going down. My father's been missing for over a year now, but today I received a mysterious package from someone who claims to have known him. Inside the package was a strange artifact like nothing I'd ever seen before. Apparently during one of his expeditions, my father had found three such relics. Two of them he was carrying with him when he disappeared, and this one he sent to me. Holding the relic in my hand, I know that it had something to do with his disappearance. Perhaps I can find it to use him. Spooky. It's locked. Oh, God. Okay. So. Fuck, I've got like a million different things to find. Gotta get the water pump. I gotta find something to unrust the hatch. I uh, need a key. I need... A wrench for to get the water pump. Uh, I'm just gonna start. Can I just beat these fucking statues with a wrench? Would that be acceptable? Because I would do it for sure. I mean, they're not. I'm not scared of them. Do you guys buy that? Probably not. Um. Added some more acoustic padding to my office, which you could see in the back, maybe partially. Let me know if it makes a difference. Uh, I'm very anal about the audio quality. Uh, I always notice an echo when I like turned up my videos to max volume and listen to the raw uh, audio. Obviously with all the game background noise and shit like that, you can't really hear it. But uh, I don't know. Hopefully it makes a noticeable Difference. Hey, buddy, you look like you're tweaking out over there. Okay, let's grab this. Uh, Coolio. From what I've seen, I think this game is about two to two and a half hours long, so hopefully... Okay, that's fun. Hopefully I'm able to finish it before my camera dies once again. Well, it's not dying. It's overheating. I think. Cog. Let's fucking go, baby. Okay. I want you to do that. Uh, I heard Mr. Chain. I don't know if I'm hallucinating that. We're kind of hinting towards all this being in my head. Like some sort of... Like they're saying they, they investigated these noises. And then there was nothing. Uh, I think I went the wrong way. The, 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 the cog was back here, right? No. Wait, what? Don't you do that. Where was it? Oh, was it through the, the shimmy shimmy? Uh, the shimmy sham? I think it was. Uh... Yeah, hopefully I can finish this before my camera overheats once more. Probably not, though. Knowing me. Okay. Okay, so it's one of these. Oh. I've only got seven moves. Okay. Interesting. I didn't mean to do that. I, I didn't mean to click that. God fucking shit. Dude, stop making me- Why can't I put it down? 
That's kind of silly that I can't put it down if I accidentally click on it. Whatever. Why can't I... I couldn't move... I couldn't select anything but those two. Okay, no, you can move it as much as you want, so what? That's not gonna work. Huh? What, what the fuck is happening here? I don't understand the rules of this puzzle. Like, why I can't move certain things? Interesting. Interesting little puzzle. Let's go, baby! Don't you fucking be weird. Another key, baby! Why am I picking up keys like this now? No, okay, that's why. Just fucking punch him. He looks like he's made out of, like, fucking, like, wet flour. He can't be that strong, right? What did I pick up? Paint locker key. Okay. Don't know why the fuck I need paint. Uh. That's not anything through here, is it? No. Don't think so. Wee -hoo. Back we venture. So we've got the water pump. Is that the engine to the left of me, or is that somebody walking? I think that's the engine. Uh, so... Where's the paint locker? Is that like the art house version of the Hurt Locker? That was a bad joke. Uh, forget I said that, please. Um... Can I go this way? No, I can't. So, where is the paint locker? No. No, no. Uh, no. Uh. I thought I was gonna touch him. I thought I was gonna touch him. I got scared, I'm sorry. Can I open this yet, maybe? No. Assuming I need some sort of solvent. Uh, okay, so it's totally again. It's it's gotta be back this way, right? That's the only place I can go. As far as I can tell. Paint locker. It's over here. Go ahead and hit that save. Cool. Grab some paint, I guess. No? What good does this do me? Oh, okay. Nice. Nicely, nicely done. I love it. I'm gonna be honest, I still don't understand this whole whistling system, but I think I'm I think I'm doing it correctly enough to keep me safe. Hopefully. So I don't know what I'd do differently. Hey, don't do that. Ooh, that's a poopy sound. All right, see you fuckers. I'm going down to the depths. I will likely not return. Now that was a much shorter ladder than I was expecting. Can I have my flashlight back? Mm, I don't really want to go down either way, but I'm going to go towards the more lit one. Ch channel my inner Travis Scott. No. Okay, I'm assuming these are both dead ends. I'm assuming I'm meant to go up the ladder. So that's where we'll go. We're not playing God of War. Okay, there's no collectibles. There's no chests. Where the fuck are we? Hmm. 
I'm just gonna assume that door is not open. Probably, probably for the best, right? The fuck am I? I'm getting lost. Dude, you're floating. You are, have mastered the art of levitation, and that's pretty concerning. Okay, so this opens up. Should I go down there? Probably. Probably. Just stick to your instinct, brother. Uh-oh. Okay, well. Oh, shit. That would have hurt. Cargo hold. Engineering. I'm literally having to, like, fight my urge to go down every possible path. It's just... Okay, shit. Sh should I have done that? So where I fell through, right? Okay, so we've, we've made a loop. We've made it back. So now we need to go put the water pump in, I'm assuming. I don't... Hey, buddy. Can you fuck off, please? You don't have to be- you don't have to be weird about it. Just let me through, I'm trying to fix your fucking ship. Okay. Chill out. Uh, I don't really remember where the fucking... Water pump even is, to be honest with you guys. That sounded really close. I don't like that. Who's following me, you fuckers? Stop being weird. Uh, where was the water pump? Was it back? Do I need to take the elevator again? I do, right? It's in the same room as the elevator, correct? I think so. I don't really know. Okay, I got an achievement, so I'm gonna assume that is the case. Hopefully, I am correct. So far, I'm really enjoying this. What was that noise? Ah, oh, shit. Okay. Okay. I take back what I said about enjoying this. I'm no longer enjoying this. I want to go home. What the fuck is going on? Rip it open, motherfucker. Cool. It somehow got darker. Nice. Picked up flare. Oh, goodness. Please know the flares here are for emergencies only. Should not be used indoors. Could cause suffocation. Cool. Damn generator went off again this morning. Last time it happened, we were stuck down here for hours waiting for the replacement parts we brought from storage. Additional spares have been left in the storage room up here in case it happens again. Perfect. Oh, so I don't even get to hold them. I just toss them. That's fine, I guess. Okay. Easy enough. Managed to escape to the service desk with a few others who were not infected. We've disabled the freight elevator so we won't be followed. It's not much, but it's at least enough. It's enough to let us catch our breath at least. We were able to scrounge together a good pile of canned food from the gallery before we left. But we have no idea how long we're going to be stuck down here. Hopefully, we'll be able to wait it out. Unlikely. Okay, so... This is just spooky ship repair simulator. I don't even, like... I kind of forget my original goal here. I gotta get, I gotta get up to the superstructure, right? That's, that's what's gonna fix all this shit? Eh, probably not. Okay, what's, what's making all this fucking noise? I should open that. I shouldn't open that. He sounds not happy to see me. Okay, dude, you gotta stop with the fucking engine noises. 
I keep thinking they're footsteps. And I don't like footsteps. Okay. If this sickness is airborne, we should probably turn off the large fan in the ventilation room to stop it circulating through the ship. We tried to get into the control room, but the door is locked. Gresham was holding onto the key, but he went to investigate the boiler room and has yet to return him. Yeah, Gresham's dead. Dead as shit. Uh... Okay, is there a replacement part in this biatch? Hopefully. Maybe a replacement flashlight? Per chance? It's locked. Perfect. I wanted it to be locked, actually. I would be disappointed if it was open. Okay. And I mean that. I really mean that. Okay. Nope. Don't. Hey. Hey. What are you doing? Nope. I don't want to go up. I want to go down. Let's... What the fuck is that noise? Actually, what the fuck is that noise? I don't like it. Chill the fuck out. I want you open. Okay, whatever. Not a big deal. And I needed a key. I mean, a, a, a code. Whatever. Yeah, just lock them all. Lock all the fucking doors. That makes things better. Okay, I'm probably meant to go through there, right? Yeah, cool. Yeah, that's where I want to be. Dude, you could just hold the fucking flare. It'd make for an all-around much more enjoyable experience. If you could just do that for me. You know? I'd appreciate it. Well, that's fucked up, man. Who's driving this ship? Stay out of the boiler room. There's something in the boiler room. Loot cornered me today. Adamant that he saw something in there. At first, I saw one of the stat thought one of the statues must have made it up here somehow. But as I approached the open door, I could hear whatever it was against the far wall just beyond the light's reach. I got out of there as quickly as I could and locked the door behind me. We should stay out of that room unless we have no other choice, but in case of emergency, the combination is 3792. Cool. I'm going to die for sure now. 3792. Got it. Where Where is the boiler room again? I'm sure it'll come back to me. What's down this way? Horrors beyond my comprehension, maybe? Oh, just the pisser. Drain water from the lower floor? Dude, you you guys are asking a lot of me. Why don't I just fucking leave? Like, why am I doing any of this? Is my path to get back to where I came from blocked off? I guess it is. Hey, buddy. Fuck off. But, like, this seems silly. Uh... Three, seven, nine, two. Which one has the key? Okay. Three, seven, nine, two. What's in here? Oh, here's a normal little guy. I'm not afraid of you. What do I need from here? A key! Dude, your leg is disconnected from your body. Yeah, let's follow that thing. That's a good idea, you fucking idiot. Yeah, let's follow the Medusa vagina. Good call, good call. Now, I was hoping that you would crouch down and enter the, the hole of death. Give me the key. Ventilation control room key. All right. I know where that goes. This thing is shifty. It keeps disappearing from my vision. How did you get through this hole without getting all kinds of rust inside your body? I don't believe that you did. Who goes there? Not my concern. It's really not. Never has been, really. Okay, back to the ventilation room. Time to turn off the fan, I guess. 
I don't fucking know. I just work here. This is not my design. And flip the lever. Cool. Can we go through there now, I guess? Maybe not. Looks like it's gated off. But why? Why do I need to turn that off then? Oh, I can. Cool. Well, that person's hanging. And someone's slurping something. So that's good. These are these are all good things. Yeah, cool. Perfect. I need more flares. Right now. Hey pal. How's it hanging? Um Who tied you up like this? That's kinda weird. Water pump controls. Oh we drained that biatch. Let's go. Someone was sleeping in here. I don't think I'm making it out of this alive. I'm the only one left. The skittering is louder now. All I can do now is sit here and watch as the last flare burns out. Well, that's bleak. You should, uh... Not be such a downer. You know what I mean? Maybe have some faith in your fellow crewmates. Okay, or not. I can see why you lost it, actually. I don't blame you. Uh, now I need to go to the bathroom and fall through that hole of death. Cool. That's what I wanted to do today. Uh, that was through... Uh, where was that? I was through here, right? I think? I don't really remember. Not gonna lie to you. Anybody here? Was that this way? Yeah, it was. You just look like a big daddy long leg. Not afraid of you. Oh, you're actually just a person. Okay, that's a little more concerning. You're like a torso. Uh, which is not good. I like my torsos connected to people. <laughs> I know. Call me crazy. Picked up more flares. Let's fucking go. I actually didn't want to come down here. Uh, I don't know what possessed me to do that. Oh, yeah. This is good. This is perfect. Dude, you're going to get all kinds of diseases. I don't like how quiet it is at all. So if we could go, please. Interesting. What's the point of that? Oh, new area. Workshop key. Let's fucking go. Locked. Not anymore, bitch. Okay. What was the point of that? Is there something in here? Uh, doesn't look like it. Huh. That's kind of weird. Anyways. Uh, I guess we can just go back up, right? I've got to be missing something down here. That was pointless. I got nothing out of that, so... Gotta be missing something, I would think. I don't really remember which way I came from, or which way I already went. Okay, I came from here. And then Mr. Torso came this way. Uh, I still need a replacement part for that generator. Which I have not found yet. I'm gonna assume that will be down here somewhere. Probably. Hopefully. Workshop. Let's fucking go. What's this? It's seized up. Cool. Fine by me. It's so fucking dark, dude. 
Okay. It's over here. Bubble cutters? Okay, the, the thing that's trained up, right? What could I need this for? Probably we'll find out. Uh, once I cut that chain, right? That's my guess. Hey, dude, stop. Stop being weird. All right, seriously. It's not a good look. Not on you. Not on you. Uh, where was that? It's around here, right? Cut those bitches! This is a good idea. You don't do anything funny. And I won't do anything mean. I'd hate... I'd hate to have to kill you, buddy. Oil. Nice. I'm assuming... That is to lubricate... The, uh... Valve. Correct? Probably. My guesses are never wrong. Never have been. So... I'm lying. I'm lying straight out of my ass. It's this way, right? This is a confusing ship. They should they should have better marked areas. That will be my suggestion once I finally meet the spider creature. I'm gonna see if they can do anything about the the signage in this establishment. Ooh, that was a nice glug glug. Alright. Replacement parts, perchance? Hopefully. Dude, I can't see a goddamn thing. Let's go, dude. That thing looks heavy. Why? Why are we making noises? Okay, let's just chill out. All of us. It's, it's time for me to go home. I've had enough of this. I don't even remember where the generator is. Okay, is the generator back... It's back this way, right? Back towards the beginning. I do believe, I do believe. Wait. Yeah. It's, it's in here. Right? Yeah, 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 Cool. Put that bitch in. And fire her up! Escape the service desk. Deck. With pleasure. Oh, okay, I was not expecting that, really. I wasn't. Dude, you have... No sense of urgency whatsoever, dude. That thing was on your ass. Where did it go? I was not expecting that to be there because there was like... I mean, obviously I heard the music. But there was no like jump scare, jump scare. I did not really like that. Fix the water pump. I have another water pump to fix. Dude, I haven't a sl the slightest fucking clue where the fucking water pump is anymore. Uh, where? I don't. I don't think it's this way. What water pump am I fixing? Yeah, no. Uh Do I have to get another part? No, 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 no. Okay, no. I'm mistaking taking off the pump for having fixed a different one. Uh I don't really remember where the water pump is. 
I think it was this way. You guys can all chill the fuck out, please. Oh! I literally walked into that. I'm a dumbass. Can you die in this game? I mean, I'm assuming you can, since my screen got red at one point. But... I, I don't know how. You just keep getting fucking hit, I guess. Let's go. Cool. Okay. I know where that is. Not that way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep whistling, you freak. Into a new, fresh hell we venture. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Find the elevator up to the superstructure. Yes, ma'am. I don't know why I keep pressing F like something's gonna change. Dude, it's kinda hard to see. Okay, that time I pressed F to see if I had any flares. Don't know how the game would have known that I was doing anything different than pressing F the first time. Maybe it's because I'm stupid. I don't know. Okay, it won't budge. That's fine. But I can squeeze through. Yes, I can, baby. You got really shiny arms, dude. What's your routine? Okay. Uh... Save that bitch. Well, fuck you too, buddy. Why even give me the option? It's too dark. Yeah, I can see that. Do I just get to take the elevator? Holy fucking pussy. I was about to say, that seemed too good to be true. Okay, that was not a very effective fall, dude. I mean, like, if you're gonna push someone like that, you might as well. The drive chain? Of course it is. Of course the fucking drive chain is missing. Why would the drive chain be present? Other fucking... This is the problem with working on a ghost ship. There's no respect for anything. People just steal drive chains all willy-fucking-nilly. No damn respect, I tell you. These kids these days, they don't, they don't understand. They don't understand that you don't take a man's drive chain. I mean, shit. Morals are lost. Values and morals are lost on the, on the new generation. This new generation of ghosts. We have got on the ghost ships. It's unbelievable. Cool, someone ate the door for me. I like that. Too dark. I'm assuming. You afraid of water? Pussy bitch. Maybe it wouldn't be all statue-esque if you got a little bit of moisture in your life. Ever think about that? This guy's trying it. He's open-minded. Be more like him. The handle is missing. Okay. Is anything not missing on this ship? Let's go down, take an inventory of the things that are here. I think would be a more effective use of our time. Light bulb. You want a fucking light bulb of the ass, buddy? Don't fucking approach me. I swear to God. We made it down into the cargo area. Okay, well, he's doing something weird to me. We were told to stay in the superstructure, but no one goes up there anymore with what's happened to the medical deck. It should be safe down here, but to make sure nothing can follow us, we've removed the drive chain from the elevator. Fuck you. You need to fuck off. Okay, don't do that again. Yeah, where'd you put it? Could you tell me that much at least? No? Cool. Who is walking around? Okay, can't use a handle as a light bulb. That's fucked up. I see you. I see you, bitch. Okay, maybe I can put a light bulb in the dark area. 
That was too dark. Nice. Ooh, more vent action. Just what the doctor ordered, baby. Are all of these people, these statues, former people? More and more crew members are finding themselves on the medical deck. More patients are experiencing chest pains and worsening symptoms. Can it be contagious? The crew are growing increasingly anxious. The best thing we can do is keep them quarantined on the medical deck. Between this fog, the engines going down, be being missed by that rescue team, and now the sickness, it's becoming difficult to keep everyone calm. Yeah, I would imagine. There's a lot of people on this ship. This is the standard amount of people on a cargo ship. Don't know. Never worked on one. Uh, cool. I like that. Dude's getting that fucking sloppy top. Oh, what, what happened over here? What the fuck? Interesting. I got the valve handle. Perfect. Hey, dude. You motherfucker who pushed me down. Push me down the elevator shaft. I will kill you. Alright, I've got a valve handle and I am really not afraid to use it. I am not afraid to use it. I've got a spider bitch who would probably love your location. But I'm not that kind of guy. I play fair. Okay? I don't play dirty like that. Can't say the same for everybody on this ship, though, that's for sure. Okie dokie. Let's go turn the tables. Why, why when I walk does it sound like seven people are walking in the water? Alright, spinna, spinna, spinna. I will fucking cry. You can get in there. Cool. You got that drive chain, baby? Hell yeah. Wait, no, that's a, that's a rope. Fuck. Dude, what'd you do with the drive chain? You fuck boy. That's just a normal chain. I've been tricked. Swindled, even. What the fuck? Where's the drive chain? I'm out of options. I don't know where else to go from here. Was there another area I couldn't explore because it was too dark? I don't think so. Let's push forward. I'm sure we'll figure this out. I thought somebody was on the ceiling. I was like, that's not good. They're evolving. They've learned how to climb. Uh, Jesus fucking cock, dude. Stop being so weird. Maybe I can explore around here now? I don't I don't really know what is left here to do. This way? No. That's where we came from. Hello, buddy. I can't imagine it's... Well, maybe it is. Let's just see. Because those those guys spawned. And you wouldn't think they would, like, plan a spawn... When you walk back from, like, a meaningless... Like, when you're not supposed to be back yet, right? So maybe... Maybe there's something I'm forgetting through here. Oh, yeah. That was too dark, right? I think. I can't really remember. But I'm... Yeah, this is new. Cool. Machinery. Perfect. Rough day. I feel you, man. I don't want to be here. It appears that those who first started showing symptoms had spent more time on the main deck. Could be exposure to the fog that's causing this strange sickness? Maybe. So far, none of the crew who have been confined to the lower decks have gotten sick. I've been outside a few times, but thankfully my duties keep me mostly indoors. 
As a precaution, the captain has ordered that the crew are not about to go above deck for any reason until further notice. Okay. Sounds like a... A sound suggestion. Okay. Uh Okay. There's probably a better way to do this. What am I doing? Because that's going to be the last one. Uh. Okay. Oops. Let's go. Don't know what that did for me. Kind of a silly system to have implemented, because then anyone can just figure out what's going on. Like, why even have a... Like, an order to begin with? You know, if it doesn't, like, shut you out or something, why even have a switch order in the first place? I don't know, man. There's a reason I didn't go into the ship captain business. This seems exceptionally dangerous. I'd be pissing my dude. Where does this go down to? Like, what? what is down there? Oh, okay. Floor. It looked bottomless. This looks like where I want to be. No, this looks really good through here. Hey, dude. Chill out. Chill the fuck out. Don't you sneak up on me. Don't you sneak up on me. That's not how you watch a camcorder. How is he filming this with no hands? He must be magic. Attention. Leave the fucking ship, pussies. Hmm. That's not good. That's not good for the soul. You better run, bitch. It's Big Daddy. Oh, this is where you died. This is where we are right now. Uh-oh. It's Spider Mommy. Ooh. Oh, there's multiple? I guess that makes sense. That's good. I'm really liking this, but my only complaint and the thing that kind of keeps constantly taking me out of the horror aspect is that, like, there's no... screams. Like, it just seems a little inhuman to see this shit happening around you and have, like, a giant spider bitch jump on you and to not scream or anything. You know? Over the last few days, the patients have been getting worse. What started as chest pain soon developed into a strange hardening of the skin and stiffening of joints until the patient is unable to move on their own. Uh-oh. The illness has already proven fatal in some cases. Stranger still, some of the bodies have gone missing from the morgue. 
We need to get the remaining patients to the hospital as soon as possible. Yeah, that didn't happen, did it? That did not happen, did it, buddy? Ooh, lots of body parts. Free lunch. If you're getting hungry. What caused that? Probably nothing good. I'm... I'm gonna go up the ladder now. No more fooling around. What is my current objective? Uh, elevator. That's right. I gotta get the chain. Okay, I don't really want to go that way because a freaky guy is standing there. I'm gonna do a little bit of a maneuver. Pressure gauge valve. Hey, fuck boy. What is wrong with you? Hey, what are these fucking noises, dude? I don't like them. Pressure gauge valve? I don't need a fucking pressure gauge valve for. I have a... Mm, I was gonna say I have one idea, but that doesn't make sense for a pressure gauge valve. No, no, no. Maybe it's that... Ow. This opened, right? Yeah. Hey, buddy, you need to run. You need to go ever so slightly quicker than this. Actually, it doesn't seem like Mr. Spider Friend is really utilizing those legs. That dude is slower than shit. Cool. The guy's a dumbass. He doesn't know he has, like, 17 legs. Uh... Probably not this way. Probably not this way, right? Maybe it is the thing back here. Or maybe it's not. Maybe it is. <laughs> okay. I'm so fucking close, man. Nice. Sure. Whatever that does. I'm here for it. Okay, we got a electronic valve, I guess. I don't really fucking know. I'm not questioning it. Okay, we are traversing into the pit of hell. Cool. This is absolutely where I'd like to be. Oh, we're in like the belly. The belly of the beast. <laughs> what you got? Chain storage key. Cool. What just happened? The helicopter is fixed up and we're almost back to the ship. What's going on there? Aha! Uh -huh. A lot of shit, brother. I'm heading up to the superstructure now to release the lockdown. I've searched lower decks and found no survivors. That's all you've got to report? Understood. We'll be there to extract you soon. We've got just got a visual on the ship. Looks like it's coming up on a large fog bank. Dude, that's all you're gonna fucking say? Okay. Do not enter the fog. I'll explain later. Fine. Well, you had better hurry then. We don't have much time before the fog reaches you. Oh, God. Aye, aye, Captain. With haste. I'm gonna die, aren't I? No way I get off this ship, right? About to get fucked up by Spider Mommy. Okay. Chain storage key. Where... Where is chain storage, though? Chain storage. Let's fucking... Tango, baby. Let's get out of here. You've got to run, brother. Okay. Put the chain in. Let's fucking get out of here. 
Take the elevator up to the super center. I cannot tell you how much I want to, actually. Words do not describe the feeling. Hurry up, hurry up. Hur Come on. Uh-oh. Dude. Hey, dude, they're closing in on me. Oh, fuck. Dude, the scan- The, f the fan scared me. Holy shit. Dude, the fucking elevator was right there. I was just on top of it. Hey, buddy. You need to speed this right the fuck along. Well, we're gonna die. We're gonna die. We're 100% gonna die here. Go, 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 go. You better fucking touch the button with some quickness. Uh-oh. Well, maybe we should have invited him. Maybe we should have seen if he wanted to come. He looked friendly, right? No, he's a douchebag. He pushed me onto an elevator. Find a way onto the bridge. Okay. Why did I not press nav? Oh, I did. It looked like I pressed C. Yeah, we're not gonna go downstairs. That's not necessary. Level three security is card guys. If you issued a key card, oh you fuck boy. On level A, is that what it said? Okay. Guess we're going down. Fucking level three clearance these days, man. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Third officer, right? That's what I need to see. Hey, brother. I need a key guard. Today. No? No key cards for me? Well, fuck are you too. I thought that was a monster. It's locked. Perfect. Who was doing that? Oh god, what is this for? Oh goodness. Wait, is he gonna kill me? Four, two, three, nine? Wait, why can I see that guy? Should I be afraid of him? Uh, please insert a blank key card. Uh, until further notice, the security disk for creating key cards will remain on me. Oh my god. Over the last few days, I've seen a number of new of crew members trying to gain authorized access to the bridge. Release the logs down. Okay, yeah, Captain Taylor. I'm sure. Well, I'm fucked. What? The lack of sound effects in this game, man. I don't really know what to do about this guy. I'm dead. What is going on? Am I good? Okay, not good. Not good. Maybe I shouldn't have whistled like a fucking idiot. You do your thing. How about you go kill the fucking guy wearing the orange stuff? I don't like him. I feel like his presence is a threat to me. Okay, go along. Be gone. Is he gone? Okay, not gonna whistle again. Okay, the, this part of the game is not... ...optimized as well. Flashlight. Are you shitting me, dude? I thought this game was almost over. Dude, why is it fucking lagging so bad? 
Okay, still locked. It's locked. Is fuckboy gone? Hopefully. I'm gonna save. Um... Okay. What did this say? Four, two, three, nine. Should I go further down? Let's just go explore the floors, I guess. Keep out. Okay. Didn't want to go that way anyways. Okay, so this part's open. Okay, nothing in there. One of these rooms will contain something useful. I can smell it. Oops. Glitch myself into a door. Don't worry, it's not the first time. Okay, those are all locked up. Nothing important there. Am I just being silly? Am I wasting time here? I feel like I might be. Anything in any of these? Oh shit. Uh, four... Two, three, nine. Is it four, three, two, nine? What? All new recruits, welcome aboard. Your personal belongings may be stored in the design. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. But is it not? Am I getting the code wrong? I think I might be getting the code wrong. My cabin key in the shower room, I believe, may have fallen down the drains. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, so I need the key, the code, but... I guess let me go check the fucking wall again. G Hackett? What the fuck do I need that for? Laundry room? Dude, what the fuck is going on? There's like a lot going on still. I thought we were almost at the end of the game. I'm fine though. Okay. Interesting. Very interesting. Add to that. Okay. Let's go back upstairs. That was a little, little spooky. Let's go back upstairs and uh, check the code. Because it, uh, clearly I did not remember it, right? I thought it was 4239. Is it 4932? I don't fucking know. 4239. What? That's what I typed in. 4239. Hold on. Uh, notes. Uh, do, 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 okay. Look at me go. Oh god, okay, what the fuck do I need all this for? Okay. Well, let me look at this one more time. Yeah, 4239, what? Surely that code is for the padlock, right? 
I would have to imagine that that's what that's for. I'm assuming my camera will die, I mean, overheat again in any moment, so. Uh, that, that's gonna suck. Four, yeah, four, two, three, nine. Okay, I guess let's go down further. See if there's anything else we can do. This is the lowest we can go, right? Okay. What is in this area? You stay back. This is not a good room to be in. These are ghosts. Why do you pick up keys in this manner? Communications room. Cool. God fucking damn it! Dude, why do you give me a chance to run? You're a very bad big daddy. I'm out of here. Just... God shit. Is he following me? Doesn't look like it. Well, that was easy. Okay. Communications room is up here. All right. Well, that's not what I meant to do. Hey, third time's a charm. Nice. What the fuck? Do I need to like do an SOS? So I can do an SOS. Everyone should know SOS Morse code. It's the easiest one. Okay, no. I don't need SOS. Uh What could I be Morse coding? Being the chief mate, Norton sits at the head of the table. Blackwood and Ackerman like a glass of wine with their meals. Layton sits opposite to Blackwood. Hackett sits at the end of the table closest to the galley. Cool, but, um... So, I'm assuming this... is that. But what the fuck do I do with the other stuff? Okay, let's continue. It, it wouldn't have given me the communications room key if I couldn't already do something in there, right? Surely? I don't know. Oh, I did not see this. Four. Okay, I'm not going crazy. This is a weird, okay. This is strange, it's a visually confusing padlock. Maybe I'm just silly. Crest. Okay, sure. Oops, fuck. What the hell? Ooh, secret. More keys, baby. Library key. Where's there a library? I think it says on, on here. Library. On the D deck. That makes sense. Um. Okay. So I'm guessing we gotta find all these nameplates. Why? What that's gonna do? I haven't the slightest fucking clue, but whatever. 
What are you holding? Give me the fucking thing, man. What was that? A wooden statue? Whoopty fucking do, baby. Punch me in the cock! Get your fucking filthy hands off me, bitch. Give me this name tag. What the fuck do I need a wooden statue for? Oh, I know what. Okay. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Uh, let's go ahead and put this down. What? Are, which one did we get? Nameplate for... Who? Cannot look? No? Cool. Whatever. Okay, Norton's is at the head of the table. Is this Norton's? No, it's Blackwood. Say Blackwood likes wine. Blackwood and Aikman like a glass of wine with their meals. And if Leighton sits opposite to Blackwood, it's got to be that one, right? Yeah. Cool. Let's go fuck with statues, baby. Shortcut. Bet you didn't know this existed. My camera is recording, right? Hopefully. Cause it's due for it's due to turn off. I don't really like that. To be honest with you. No, fuck. Shit, no. Whatever. Oh. These cats are cooking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks. Thanks for letting me turn that off. I appreciate it. Yeah, back to the fucking lag factory. What the fuck? Oh, I can... It's one of these. What am I attempting here? Am I trying to, like, make it the same as him? Because I can do that. Okay, the, the controls are a little weird. Dude, what? They're not... This is a fucking brain fuck. Is this not what you want? Yeah, but how do I fucking get you the to rotate the way I need you to? Cool. Okay, we've got another name card and then a napkin. Twelve seven two five. What do I need that has knobs? Who do I have? Aikman. Who sits across Aikman? Latent is opposite to Blackwood, so Aikman goes here. Cool. Uh, what am I missing? And there she goes. Okay, camera has turned off. It's about time, really. All right, you guys know what they say. Third time is the charm. I believe we should be able to finish the game this time around. Uh, I keep forgetting what I'm doing. Oh, yeah, I've got that rotary key pad. Sorry, I was kind of taken out of it when my camera dies because I usually give it like 30 to 45 minutes to cool off. So... Like, I've been recording this for, like, 
four hours total. And I've only been playing the game for like two hours. So, you know. I start to sort of forget uh, a little bit while I'm taking a break what I'm actually doing. But I don't know what this rotary uh, key is. This, this? No, that's a coffee maker. Uh, I don't know what this rotary shit is going to be. Um, I thought maybe it was some really weird way to, like, tell me that it was the keypad. You know, like, you gotta do a certain amount of rotations from the, from zero, but that, that didn't work. I already tried that. Uh, I don't think it's on this floor. I, th I think it's somewhere else. Wait a second. Oh, okay. I thought maybe there was something uh, external locking that door, but no. Okay. I am a little bit confused. Not going to lie to you. Anything here? No, no, no. Okay, so I, I need to get... <clears throat> I need to get the... The thing out of the... Like... Locker room to get the key out of there. I just, I just don't know what to do. What the fuck, man? I guess that makes sense. And that's kind of what I thought at first. I just kind of forgot that I had that sheet. Whatever. Okay, cool. Whatever. Silly me. Silly, silly me. Dude, there's no chance in hell you have the dexterity to do that. Officer's key. What is this even for? The, uh, is there an officer's room on the first floor? I think there is. There's two. There's a captain's room, and then there's something else. Dude, get off me, you freaky bitch. I'm trying to get off the fucking ship, and I'll take you with me. Okay, if you just stop slowing me down. Golly. Maybe he's trying to save me. Maybe he knows that I'm talking to a, a phantom. My crew's not actually out there. You ever think about that? Let's fucking go. Okay, this is what I was doing. Okay. One, two, three. Oh, wrong way. Reset. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. One, two, three, four. Was it twelve, seven? Seven. Two, five. I think I got that wrong. Okay, that's interesting. Whatever. I mean, I guess that makes sense, but in my mind, the arrow was going clockwise, so they wanted you to turn it clockwise. I, I feel like that's an, a pretty reasonable assumption. But whatever. Okay, let's go place the last nameplate. That's apparently infused with magic or something. It's a strange puzzle to be able to create here, but hey. I'm fine with it. It's one more down, right? I do believe, I do believe. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, 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 I do believe. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Jesus fucking ball sack. Every time, man. Asshole. This is the only one left, right? Okay, fuck. What did I get wrong? Okay, hold on. Let's see. <sighs> Norton sits at the head of the table. Do I got Norton at the head of the table? No, I don't. I'm. S what am I? S why? What? Why did I put that there? No. 
No? Okay, we got Norton at the head of the table. Layton sits opposite to Blackwood. Hackett sits at another table closer to the galley. So Blackwood and Aikman have wine. And Blackwood has to be here. Because if Hackett sits closest to the galley, to the end of the table, then... Unless I'm... I don't know what the galley is. What's the galley? I don't know ship terminology, okay? I don't claim to know it. Oh, okay. Fair enough. So these two need to be swapped. What the fuck? Oh, yeah, and then these need to be swapped. Because they want to sit across from each other. Nice. <laughs> I thought there was a slight moment there. I was like, oh, fuck. Okay, I have no idea what I'm doing wrong then. If that didn't fix it. Okay, cool. Captain's key acquired. Okay. Ha. Ah, hey, buddy. Why the fuck did you do that? That was unnecessary. Okay, I can't hide in the fridge. Why not? That seems kind of fucked up. I could hide in the fridge if I wanted to. Hey, buddy. Where are you going? I'm going to close this. I'm going to just juke around your ugly ass. You ain't never seen nobody as quick as me. I'm the quickest man in this land, motherfucker. Okay. Cool. Now we should be able to make a key card and get the fuck out of Dodge. Ideally. We'll see. Yeah, 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 I hear ya. Dude, why is it so fucking laggy? That's really unnecessary, dude. Okay, well, he disappeared. I was just let him do his thing. Archives. You're joking. Oh, shit, we're in the... The Forbidden Sector. Escape the medical deck. Oh, yeah, this is a bad place to be. This is not where I want to be. Yeah, no shit, it's locked. There's a hundred padlocks on it, but what do I do? Okay, y'all all look pretty normal. Patients appear to be suffering from an unknown illness. The illness progresses as follows. The patient experiences intense chest pain, which will worsen over time. Fagi Fagid. Fatigue begins to set in, and the color of the patient's skin begins to take on a paler tone. The patient will begin to show signs of impaired mobility due to the stiffening of the joints. X-rays show signs of calcification of internal organs, beginning from the lungs and then spreading out throughout the rest of the body. This makes breathing difficult for the patient. Calcification begins to affect the skin as well, giving the patient a stone-like appearance. Illness seems to be related to the length of exposure to the fog, with the quickest deaths occurring within two days, while others have survived for up to two weeks. Death in most cases is respiratory failure caused by excessive calcification of the lungs. However, the process seems to continue even after death until the body has been calcified. Gross. Icky. Not cool. I don't want to go down here. Not even a little. Not even slightly. But we're going to, because why the fuck not? Give me the padlock key, baby. I'm not worried. I can whistle. I have the ability to whistle, and you don't, bitch. I'm leaving. Dude, no way one padlock unlocks all that shit. Okay, I need another one. I need three total. Two more. Okay, makes sense. Okay, brother. Don't get so close to me. Your tricks don't scare me, bitch boy. Oh! O operation gone wrong, baby. Stop being weird, dude. I've already explained to you that you can come with me. I don't care. Like, seriously. You can't come on the helicopter with me because you're weird and stinky, but... 
If you want to escape, just follow me. Like, stop being a fucking freak. Dude, chill the fuck out. Calcified ass bitch. Imagine getting your lungs calcified. Could never be me. Not even a, not a single day in my life would I allow that to happen. Okay, I hope I don't actually need more than two. We good? Let's go, baby. Okay. Time to go to the captain's quarters. How do I get through? I fell through the fucking floor. Oh, well, yeah, this goes around. Duh. Oh, duh. Okay, Captain's Court. What? Oh, wait, already, I've already gone to his fucking quarters. That's right. Sorry. <laughs> Where do I get a key card from? Wait, what? What the shit, brother? Where are the key cards? No, like, actually, where's the blank key card? I don't know. You're a fucking idiot, August. Okay, cool. Let's go, baby. It's time to escape this fucking place. This hellhole. Totally, why am I ugly? That was unfair to say. I didn't really mean to say, why am I ugly? I meant to say, why am I a real person? The ship will be entering the fog any minute now. Where the hell are you? I'm coming, I'm coming. I'm coming, Simon. It just took me off. Scott, you're a great looking man. It just took me off guard that I was real. Like, why? Why make me real? Nothing else has been photorealistic this entire game. You know? Release the lockdown. Uh... Yeah, sure. Because I can do that. I've got the power, I'm sure. Probably need to go fucking... Repair 16 elevators before it'll let me pull this lever. We're free, baby. Let's go. I'm gonna escape. Don't have to tell me twice. Don't turn my flashlight off for me. It's still dark. Run. Run, 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 run. I'm tired of being on this hellhole. This godforsaken ship. I'm here! Drop a rope! Save me! Oh god. You better run, Scott. I mean, Simon. I mean, John. I don't really know my name. Oh shit. Run! Run! Make a jump for it! Let's fucking go. Just like that, baby. And my- all my crewmates are made out of cal calcium now. Aren't they? The pilot- the pilot will be a calcium man, won't he? No? Ooh, and the fog is overtaken. The fog just ate that ship right up. It happens. Happens to the best of them. Let's fucking go, baby. Nice. Okay. You know what? I, I quite enjoyed that quite a bit. I liked that. That was a nice, fun little game. It could have been like 15 minutes shorter. I think, okay, I think it dragged just ever so slightly, but not really enough to complain about it. That was a good, that was a fun game. The scares got a little bit predictable as the game progressed, but I still got caught off guard quite a few times. The first 30 minutes to an hour were definitely super eerie. I was really on edge for a lot of that time. And for me, that's really all you can ask from a game like this. It's very, very rare I get actually scared by a horror game. So keeping me on edge for hours, I'll take it. I enjoyed that. I liked that. I would like to see more from you, Aegon game. Games. That was solid. But like always, let me know what you guys thought and let me know what you want to see me play next. Uh, hopefully, I don't sound like this the next time you hear me. We'll see. See ya.